Lewis, you are in. Hello. How's it going? Hello. What is uh, uh, Lewis yes. Cypher? What are your pronouns? He. He, him? Okay. Yeah. All right. Sure. Okay, your your audio is a little a little bit uh, fuzzy. Can you move your mic a little bit closer to your uh, face and 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 make sure that you're like uh, you don't have a lot of background noise and stuff? I'm trying to find a quiet room right now. I'm with family and I'm trying to steal. Away, I'm stealing away some time for this. Okay, fair enough. All right. Well, I appreciate you coming on. Uh, it's very rare that right wingers come on. So, and you would describe yeah, yourself as a right winger, right? Uh, I, I would describe myself as a Republican. Yeah. Okay. All right. So what, what do you want to talk about? You want to talk about your, uh, your, your president and, and your, uh, your fellow Republicans storming the, uh, the Capitol to overthrow democracy or, or what, what is it? What did you want to talk about? Well, I'm not, I'm not really, uh, I don't really care much about that situation. Um, I'm not throwing myself at the mercy of the court. I think that we've, entered like this uh, i think we've crossed the rubicon okay. and what is that what do you mean by that well, when you say when you say we've crossed think, the rubicon what do you mean i think that we're moving into a uh, point in american history where nothing matters it's going to be a kleptocracy um pretty much uh like if you see what's happening in california and baltimore that um this whole institution has become a joke so ask me if i care about Ask me if I care about um, the situation with, uh, with with people storming the gates for a photo op. I, I really don't care. After, I mean, it wasn't just point, a photo op. You know that people died there, right? They were. Yeah. 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 Also, also, not, quick question: when you when you referred to uh, what's going on in Chicago and California, what do you mean by that? Like, like I'm I don't know what you mean when you say what's going on. What is going on in those yeah, places in your mind? I'm talking about the failure of uh, a government centered on pathological altruism, um, critical race theory, identity politics. Uh, is that what you to, think our uh, government is based on? Basically, no, 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 no. This is where the floodgates gets open for the identity politicians and the critical race theorists to okay. come in. Well, because you just said that, and, the, that the, the government that was based on that has failed. But you're set now. Now I'm, you're saying you've changed California, what you were saying. Ca California, Chicago, Baltimore, Atlanta. Those are the states I'm talking about. Okay. The government itself is this 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 wave of um, corruption is moving into Washington, and the fact that a few rowdy proud boys run up on the stage is really of no consequence. That wasn't really just was proud boys, you know. They were flying a Confederate flag. They were I, um, those I were people with those were people who are who are avowed Nazis. No, well, I'm 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 not um, one of these Nazi phobic kind of I I think that that's an old meme and I don't what care. What do you mean anymore. by Nazi phobic? Not the Nazis. Do you not, not believe that the Nazis I'm, exist? I'm not, I'm not going to click my heels and start acting panicky as soon as some progressive shout the terms nazi it's, it wait, doesn't wait, mean anything to me this isn't you just shouting that a term to the ground wait that's not just shouting you a term ran, these are nazis these are people who self-identify as nazis i mean i do not consider them nazis you consider them Nazis. no because they consider themselves nazis no you consider them nazis because they are calling them nazis is conducive to your financial no. opportunity no i don't care you're you're, you're just even, but you're just lying though like many of Am the people I, okay, who are involved okay. in this are confirmed oh, as no, Nazis. No. Yeah. Okay. No. Wait. 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 That's also, not my concern. Just so you know. That wait. Wait. Here's concern. another example. Didn't you say? I'm sorry. And I may be wrong here. Didn't you say you were a black conservative? I'm a black Republican. Okay. So you're you're a black Republican. Doesn't it concern you that there are people flying the Confederate flag, um, the the flag of a of a uh, of a a traitorous attempt? to preserve slavery in the United States as a black Republican? Doesn't that concern you? It doesn't, it doesn't concern me. They're not in power. But they're trying to take they're, power. And their guy is power. in power. Their power. They don't have the social currency to take power. But you're moment. saying you want so them I, to, don't you? Every wolf suffered. What's that? Aren't you, aren't you more or less saying that you want them to? By saying that you don't care about these things, but as they attempt to overthrow, yes, you they did a bad to, job. You'd okay, wait, you'd have to define the they first. Like, 
if there's a good person in that crowd and you point at the whole crowd and say they are Nazis, they are Confederates, they are uh, ethnic cleansing rape soldiers from Germany 1920, I'm like, wait, wait, wait. All of them? Uh, no. Wait, wait. I don't on. care. So, it's... so you're telling me that the crowd of people wearing Trump flags, flying multiple people in there, flying openly Confederate flags, and the people who went into the Capitol it, with them, I'm... that are you trying to tell me that like that's not like a crowd of people who are at the very least, if, even if we're incredibly, incredibly charitable, at the very least, very okay with that? That feels like that, that feels in... like willful wait, 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 ignorance. Wait, wait, wait. Hold it, hold it, hold it. Don't 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 answer a question. Then wait until I take a deep breath before you interrupt me. Excuse I'm me. I'm telling you that they are inconsequential and that they are powerless. They have been powerless for over forty years. Right, and you're arguing that they should have more power right now. You've come on and said and said you oh, don't no, no, give no, a shit no, that they've no, attempted to hurt no, people. No, no, yeah. I'm saying that. Hold it. I'm saying that your concept of they is not my concept of they. You would gladly label every Republican with that brush because, once again, it is conducive to your economic opportunities to paint every Republican with a broad brush. Wait, that so doesn't make I any don't sense. care what your concept of they is. Just show me the person. Show me the person in particular that I'm, suppo I'm not supposed no to support. No batter, no batter, a black you know? person don't, can don't point at me. Fashion. Don't point me to a crowd and tell me to think a certain way. No, right. I deal with ideas, it, not images. I, I literally did exactly that. I, I told you very no. specifically that the no, guy maybe. who was flying a Confederate flag inside the White House, did you know that the guy who is pictured uh, uh -huh. sitting in Pelosi's seat is an avowed white nationalist, a.k.a. he believes that I you do not that. belong in this country? How do you feel I about that? that? I understand that, and I understand that the uh bad actors are going to get the most attention wait how is that a bad they, actor there was a crowd of people who followed these actors. people in do you think okay. that those people okay. who stormed the capitol were a wait, bunch wait, of good would actors you would you understand it better if i said the bad guys are going to get the most attention so that we could under we could they be on the same stormed footing. the capitol they're trying to wait, get attention right. and guess Tell what donald trump went light on them donald trump said oh i love you how do you feel about that how do you feel about think, Donald Trump saying that he I loves – wait, hold on. You have to let me actually ask, ask the question. How do you feel about your, the fact that Donald Trump is tacitly and explicitly in many cases endorsing people who believe that you don't belong here because of your skin color? In, in, how about this? No, answer I'm the question. Only, Just answer the question. I, uh, come on. Dude, dude, dude. What made you think I wasn't going to answer the question? I was going to amplify – that question sure see i am not only black american okay but i'm also from haiti the quote-unquote shithole country that donald trump attacked i've known of donald trump longer than you have been alive mm, well maybe I, yeah yeah trust me it, it's, it's it's a funny story actually okay i'm not only telling you that i don't care what happened that day mm -hmm. if i was donald trump to thumb my finger in the eye of this progressive hysteria, I probably would have, I don't know, sent out for pizza and played I'm proud to be an American over the loudspeaker. Hmm. This has absolutely so, nothing to do with the oncoming policies. This so, is just a temper tantrum from a party that's moving out of power. And I'm telling you once again that they are irrelevant. They are me they are they are disenfranchised and they're doing what disenfranchised people but do. But you would like it's it if they weren't. You um, just said you would like it if they weren't. You just said that you would vote for like Donald said, Trump. That depends. That depends on your definition of they. No, we wait. This is that doesn't make any sense. You're literally speaking nonsense right now. You no, just they, wait. I'm no, stop it. They. Stop. You just uh -huh, said. You just said that you would gladly vote for a guy who called your home country, or I don't know if it's your home country, but your home, your country of ancestry, uh, a shithole country, a guy who endorses white nationalists who gives them power oh, by who wait i'm not done who gives them power who amplifies their voices allegedly. who makes them a strong he does allegedly. this is objectively true like you cannot uh, there's oh, no argument gonna, against this it is no. it is objectively true it is it has been oh, absolute you objectivism. wait what do you believe in objectivism objectivism is a philo philosophical um a, a philosophical belief that is so not that is not what you think truth. it means do you believe in absolute truths? 
I believe that the truth can be determined by observing and comparing facts. That has do nothing to do with objectivism. objectivism. Do you know what objectivism is? Oh, I know. Oh, trust me, I know. What, no, what is it? What is, can you define objectivism for me real quick? Ayn Randian, Ayn Randian objectivism. Yeah, do you know what I, it means, though? Obje I don't think it's... I don't, no, 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 hold it, hold it, hold it. Let me, let me make a small point. Your intention is to paint every last Republican with this objectivist perspective of racism. And what? I could tell you from That is the not start, what objectivism I not, means. I do, hold it, hold it. I do not, I do not um, coincide with your purviews of racism because as I've seen it countless times, the Democratic Party's belief in racism stems from what gets the Democratic Party elected. Thus, it is only for your financial uh, 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 in, uh, um, betterment that you call them racist. What? You, you get what I'm saying? I don't know. I don't know I what you're talking I don't about. Trust you, you, judgment. No, no, you, you've just said a bunch of things biased. that makes I no sense. None of this it. makes any sense to me. First of all, okay, you're biased. How about that? You, you think you're I'm biased. Wait, what am I biased against? You're biased because you're trying to use a subjective term like racism as an objective weapon. What do you do? Okay, let's, let me ask you this. What do you define racism as? My, my belief in racism, my personal okay. belief in racism yeah. is that when you are willing to stop a human being for, from feeding his family okay. because of his race. Yeah, and you do realize that's like pretty much been the purview of the Republican Party for most of the last century, right? Like that, that is, is a verifiable fact. Interpretation of it. No, that no, no, is that is verifiable fact. You can look at the that laws. Wait, wait, wait. Listen, stop, 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 stop. You went off on some random unhinged rant. Let me, let me talk. No, I'm answering your question. You're, not, you're trying to, you're trying to sneak in. I'm not trying to sneak in anything. Objectivity into subjective opinion. What do you mean? I do not wait, what are you, what are you talking about? Reasons. Wait, you, do you think that, do you think, do you believe in facts? Do you believe it's possible to verify anything? I don't believe that you as a person who gets financial compensation from playing the race card is wait what do you mean hold on a second what financial wait wait can you verify that what what financial compensation wait no 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 stop 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 every please time. please okay. stop shut up shut up you you keep rambling every time i try to make any sense of this conversation so you're going to have to stop and either answer the questions or run away crying so let's calm down and let's let's answer these questions all right when you accuse me of receiving money by playing the race card, what do you mean by that? I believe that your purviews of racism is completely in line with what will get you super chat. Super? Wait, so, so you, do you I think that like, wait, you think that like I say racism bad and just magical super chats? Like, wait, do, do you even know anything about my channel? Like, do you know anything about how much I make or anything like that? Or is this just like fantasy and feelings? Not important. Irrelevant. <laughs> if I see You really don't things, have arguments. You just have feelings. This is all uh, your feelings. Okay, sure. If I see so 15 you, football wait, games, wait, I'm pretty sure. Hold on a second. On like, you, you were in my, you were in my comments. Message. You were in my comments like for like mm -hmm. a couple of days saying about how you were going to school progressives and all of this nonsense. And you come in just going, I feel, I feel like you're a dummy. I feel like you're playing the race card for money, I but you don't have any evidence. Television. You don't actually have any evidence of anything you believe. Okay, go ahead. Do you? I, I, if that, but is, wait, wait. Is that what we're here to explain whether or not I have evidence? Because I'm, like I said, I'm talking about this off of my top of my head. I'm not holding on to any notes. I'm just telling you the Democratic platform is completely in line with calling people racism because it grants them power, and you personally, it gives you opportunities for super chats. So you throw Vosh in that list too. Oh, okay. So this is about. Do you have like? Did you have? Do you have like some sort of weird thing about Vosh? Is that like? Is that like why you came here? You oh, couldn't yeah. get on there. I think. I think. Well, I don't want to. I don't want to side skirt the issue, but Vosh is a perfect example of um, uh, Machiavellian uh, gamesmanship. Machiavellian I think he, you, 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 you really just you really just have a fantasy in your head, and you don't actually look to find out if any of it's true. Let me just ask you something. L let me ask you something. Do you believe it's possible to discover to like to understand anything in the world, or do, is the way that you understand the world just through like feeling, like? For example, before before you answer the question, for an example, um, if you were to like, you know, observe something and something was like, hmm, that makes me feel weird. Would you attempt to like verify those feelings with any sorts of facts or do you just always go with your gut? No, no, I'm not even trying. No, that's not the um, 
that's not how I uh, view things. Okay. I think that, so how uh, do you determine science, that something is true? Okay, I was about to explain. Sure. Science is the study of reoccurring phenomena. Okay. So if a phenomenon reoccurs, then I will fall in line with that belief structure. Mm -hmm. But as I see it right now, the phenomenon of calling someone racist so that you could get a leg up on them, so you, that you could destroy their platforms, or that you could humiliate them and collect super chats, is the prevailing phenom is the prevailing philosophy of left wing bread tubers mm -hmm. and okay. debate bro. You have no evidence of that, though. That's what I'm saying. Like you've now um, you, you're coming on here and you're saying that, well, but you don't actually have an argument for that. And here, let me tell you something. How do you know? Mm -hmm. How do you know that these people don't actually just believe what they say? Like for example, I can assure you. For I could I could I could promise you I would vow to you before God that I very much believe in what I say that I very very much believe that I engage with a lot of racists and that the Republican Party is deeply deeply racist and I base this off of an incredibly uh, long process of gathering information of studying these things and taking it seriously as a career. So what do you say to that? Do you think it's impossible that anybody on BreadTube or anybody on the left really believes um, in racism? Look, or is it, is it just um, inconvenient for you to think that so you just call them all grifters no, without evidence? No, no, no. I just see a reoccurring phenomenon of what? BreadTubers using racism to, to pad their super chats, and I call it out. To pad Whether their super chats? What if they, a, what if they just— a magical unicorn that doesn't do it, that's irrelevant wait, wait. to me. I do you, think, you, do you think that it's possible that, that they actually are calling out racism and people are paying them because they support that? I think they're all a bunch of grifters. I think they oh, call but you don't have any evidence, though. Them. Like, what evidence do you say that they're lying? Evidence? Yeah, what, evidence. Yeah, evidence. You want evidence? Yes, evidence. Okay, um, okay. How about, okay, um, Vosh versus, um, I'm sorry, I'm going to have to use Vosh because you don't think I, uh, I understand anything about him. Um, Vosh versus, um, what is his name? Actual Justice Warrior. Okay. This Vosh okay. Some... had the unadmitted gall to use Ferguson statistics okay. to claim that racism in Ferguson, Missouri was an objective fact. And um, actual justice warrior asked Vosh, hey, uh, but do you think that um, the officer should have uh, protected himself from Mike Brown? Vosh looked at the camera and says, who's Mike Brown? That's grifting, my friend. That, wait, I'm like, wow. Wait, so you think grifting? You think grifting is when somebody forgets a specific name? No, I, I don't think. No, no, no. Vosh has a tendency of playing stupid. It's performative incompetence. It's one wait, of the, it, it's, wait, wait, like, wait. You literally actually, you actually don't, you don't believe that people are people, do you? It's just like you assign this. Wait, wait, hold on. Wait, hold on. Wait, 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 wait. Hold on. Listen. You have to have a conversation. It's not here just to have you pontificate. Don't lecture me on conversation. I will lecture I you if I want to. Okay? Yeah, Listen. Okay, cool. Um, cool. When it comes to this, like, do you not think it is possible? Like, first of all, I don't even know about this debate. I, I, I've i never seen this debate. I don't, or at least I don't think I have. Maybe I watched it like a year ago. Um, so I can't, I can't, I can't comment on the specifics. But do you not think it is, it is possible that uh, Vosh didn't remember a name? Or are you just jumping to a conclusion that aligns with your your own biases and feelings? Because that's what it sounds like. It sounds no, like you have I, like it's, wait, wait wait hold on I'm not done. It sounds like you have presumed an outcome that you want to be true, which is that Vosh is a grifter, and you will justify it no matter what, regardless of whether there might be another explanation. Like for example, maybe he uh -huh. just forgot a name. Uh huh. Sure. Okay. Wait. What do you mean? I'm not sure. Wait, okay, no, no, uh, sure. Okay, my personal experience with Vosh is when he was on a live stream ripping South Park, saying that they're, 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 they're white nationalists and, and stuff like that. And then I tested my theory. I put up 10 bucks of my own money and I asked Vosh, look, South Park might be uh, uh, like MAGA chuds on, 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 up front, but they have a way of sneaking medicine in the dog food like in season 19 where they made a couple of characters gay they they um talked about gentrification and they talked about communism Vosh's response was like oh i don't watch i don't watch self Park." like i said uh, okay it, it, so he was wrong wait 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 this is a completely was, different wait hold on wait wait i'm responding to this now this is a completely different example that has something to do with Vosh being wrong about 
South Park they, were being, according to you, wrong about South Park. So let me ask you this. If, if Vosh was wrong about South Park, how does that prove that he's a grifter? And not that he was just um, wrong. So like, do you see what I'm saying? What's happening here again and again and again on every single every single thing that you uh, that you allege, you make these big alleging. Wait, hold on, I'm not done yet. Every single time you allege something <laughs> about myself or another creator or the left in general, you're very vague about it. And and then and then when very I ask you for like proof yeah. or evidence of those things, you say okay. something totally random um, that doesn't prove your point. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. I mean, you are literally okay, doing look, that multiple times do you, now. Do you understand? Look, do you understand that I could only bring to you the phenomenon that I have witnessed with my of own course. eyes and which could be backed up? And whether you choose to in, embrace that um, phenomenon as something reoccurring has nothing to do with me. I have stated my case. I'm not looking but for But your case judgment. is weak I'm is what I'm saying. You, I'm telling you the phenomenon that I've observed as someone who don't trust white progressives for virtue signaling sure because virtue wait wait wait, wait. there it goes you did it again you just did it again right now that is called motivated reasoning you are cherry picking uh -huh. you are cherry picking uh -huh. examples that uh -huh. agree with your bias you've already uh -huh. concluded that all progressives uh -huh. are virtue signaling degenerate whatever the fuck you want to say and now you're just cherry picking okay, for things uh, wait when when i ask you about something and you give me an example and i say what makes you think that it's this way? And then you say, well, I don't know. I just feel like that. That is literally feelings over facts. What do you mean I just feel? I told you, I told you that I, I've observed phenomenon and yeah. I've tested and, and my And I, I said, do you not think it's possible that it was another way? And you go, no, I don't feel that it was. Well, look, So you dude, just, look, you don't actually have any actual evidence. You just dude, have your feelings about dude, things. All I could do is tell you the phenomenon that I witnessed and that they reoccur, whether you choose to believe it or not, is immaterial. I'm just telling okay, you. Okay, but you also allege this about me. Exploitation of the African community I see within the LGBT bread tube arena. You don't have to believe Wait, me. I'm sorry, I'm not what? Asking you to. I'm sorry, can you repeat you that again? You don't have to believe me. Oh, uh, the phenomenon of LGBT exploitation of black causes under bread tube lgbt and, and, and whatever can you provide an example of that i'm like i oh god um <laughs> okay <laughs> what did you okay then, then then let's bring it on home sure. did you see the jangle science lad milo yiannopoulos debate yeah i did yeah what does that have to do with exploiting um, black people by lgbt like you you're, you're well, alleging some sort of conspiracy or something it's not a conspiracy. It's a reoccurring phenomenon. Wait, wait. Okay, before you say it's a reoccurring phenomenon, what is the phenomenon? Are you saying, like, what are you actually alleging? Are you saying, like, wait, 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 I have to ask the question, dude. Listen. Uh -huh. When you say the LGBT bread tube, uh, which is pretty vague, because, first of all, bread tube is a pretty vague concept. Who are you talking about, and what are you saying they're doing? Okay. Uh, you, let, let me show run off a list of LGBT uh, bread tubers, um, Jangle Science Lab. Okay. Right? Yeah. You. Okay. Uh, Vosh. Sure. Um, I wouldn't, uh, philosophy tube. I'm not going to put ContraPoints in that list. Why? Um, armor guy. Because ContraPoints is more of a um, centrist, in a, in a sense. Um, I don't think well, you've watched look, much ContraPoints, contra if you think contra that's the case. ContraPoints understands the limitations of her philosophy and... I'll just leave it at that. Okay. But what I'm saying is that there is a general consensus. I'm excuse me. There's a general uh, grouping, a, a, a Venn diagram okay. of homosexual or queer men okay. who move on to bread tube. Wait, but I'm not a and, queer. I'm not a homosexual or queer man. Uh, what, what would you identify yourself as? I'm a woman. I'm a non-binary okay. trans woman. You never okay. bothered right. asking. Non-binary, non but you understand that the term queer used to be considered a catch-all term for everybody on the I don't care. Level. I don't care what it used to be concerned. We're, okay, we're, having, well, a con we're respect, having a conversation you, in 2021. It is, uh, what, January okay, 8th, right, 2021? Well, oh, we're getting sidetracked. We're getting sidetracked on minutia. No, I'm no, just I'm saying, just being clear. Also, yeah, wait a second. Sidetrack. Also, I have another follow-up question real quick because you, you've said a couple sure. of things, but... Um, but I, I have a couple of questions. So when you say there's like an LGBT, you're being, again, you're being very vague. You're like, oh, there's this, this grouping oh, of people. God, like, I gave you names. Wait, you gave me names, but you're saying, you're, you're alleging that they're like together in some way. I think I've talked to Jangle Science Lad like once in my entire life. 
and I, I mean, mm -hmm. I, I admittedly did, I do have some connections to Vosh's community, but I have no connections to Philosophy mm -hmm. Tube. So how are we mm -hmm. connected? What is this connection? I, I'm not, I'm not here to connect the dots. I'm here to tell you. Real you're you're here to, to vaguely gesticulate your feelings into the air that are completely based off of a, a fantasy that you've imagined. You imagine that all these gay mm -hmm. people on YouTube are like pulling mm -hmm. strings or something. Um, well, <laughs> let's, let's, let's be concise here. Sure. Uh, there is, there is a certain MO that you, uh, Vosh and let's say jungle science, Vlad, et cetera. Okay. You follow. There's, there's a certain MO that What's you. What's the MO? Uh, berate, attack, destroy. And, um, it's, it's basically a debate strategy of rather than understanding, uh, the actionable policies you advocate for, you'd probably rather destroy the individual human being. And the perfect target for you guys what? is white men. Who are you? Ta what are you talking about? What I'm the saying fu you wait, fight what dirty. the fuck are you? You're saying, wait, okay. Like you're all over the place here. You do realize that this I'm comes sure from, I, I mean, you really are like, this is very disorganized. I'm sure I, am. I mean, you're saying like, there's yeah. this MO of trying to destroy white men or something like, what, like, I have a lot of white male friends. Like I have a lot of people in my space who are white men. I like. What are you talking about? What evidence do you have of that? Okay. Well, Wait. What do you mean? Okay. I don't have this is literally all you've done is just come in here and just literally stated your feelings with no evidence for any of the claims. And you're making big mm -hmm. claims too. You're making claims mm -hmm. that there's like a secret. Sure. There's sure. a secret gay. It's uh, not a secret. It's a reoccurring. It's just a reoccurring you keep behavior. saying reoccurring I'm behavior, but you don't you actually mean? say what the reoccurring behaviors are. What the fuck are you talking okay. about? You sound like an, right. you, I'm, I'm sorry, but you sound like an unhinged mm -hmm. conspiracy theorist. It's not a conspiracy theory. It's just a pattern of reoccurring behavior. What is it's the a pattern? Modus operandi. LGBT exploiting um, political causes under the veil of vulnerability and virtue signaling. Okay, so that's a lot of different allegations. So when you say exploiting, what do you mean by that? How do you exploiting. how do you define exploiting the cause? Exploiting the cause, as in um, Black Lives Matter, for example. That's an LGBT movement. Um, what? Black Lives yeah, Matter is LGBT. an LGBT movement. It's an LGBT. Do you know movement. anything about what you what you actually what you actually talk about, or is, or I'm do black. you just completely I'm go black. off of it? Like you. You're I'm not, black. I'm here to let you. Uh, that's not how it works. Like, see, it's funny because you're breaking out. You're breaking out the type of um, the type of like pathetic, low, like tiny brain id poll that like you would accuse other people of doing. But just because you come in here, wait a second. Just because you come in here and say I'm black doesn't mean you're right. It will never mean that you're right just because you're black. And in fact, what you're You'd saying right now, what you're saying right now is that uh, that I should take it because you have because your skin is black. I should take it on um, on tr on faith that BLM is secretly an LGBT movement secretly. that's being puppeted by a a group of YouTubers that you think are are um, are are. No, 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 no. What do you mean? No, 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 no. Now, now you're making connections that I never made. You literally you said not, that. Not, you literally not, said. Not, hold on, hold on a second. No, no. I want I want this to be clear. Something about something you said. No. You literally said that. Vosh, myself, Philosophy Tube, Jangle's Science Lad are taking advantage of the BLM LGBT movement to push a conspiracy to destroy the white man. No, 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 no. That's what, yes, you literally no. said that. So can no, you clarify no, no. then? I'm... Because that is what you actually said. Okay, all right. Give me, give me a long breath. Sure, please you, do. Vosh, and the rest of the YouTube BreadTube debaters. Okay. are not on the level of Black Lives Matter. Okay. They're just pitching their wagon onto their movement. Oh. And their movement, which was started by, correct me if I'm wrong, three lesbians, right? I don't recall. Right? There's there's both a you movement. Know, there's not. both a movement and there's an organization. Oh, of, course not. Oh, of course not. Look, look at the founders of Black Lives Matter. It sure. came out of Tumblr. It came out of... Uh, came three, out of um, okay, so now Tumblr's in on it too? don't really care about Black men either. Sure. Okay. I mean, it seems like they care. Really care it seems like them. both the organization and the movement care a lot about black men. Like, they in fact, it seems like they talk attention. about it all the time. Also, um, don't get it twisted, bro. Excuse my language. Don't get it twisted. They care about getting media attention. <laughs> Look, 
let, let, let me paraphrase uh, Jordan Peterson, all right? Please try. If you show, if you show a man a problem, he's going to want the solution immediately. If you show a woman a problem, she's going to want the solution, and she's, want to, she's going to um, want to do the calculus of how we got into that problem in the first place. Oof, that was a little rough. That's Jordan Peterson. Oh, hold it, hold it. That was really rough. That's Jordan that's Jordan Peterson. Yeah, but what that was I'm a really rough is, paraphrasing. Show, I'm saying I don't know what you're actually. That, that didn't make you, any sense to me. Uh, you're 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 bogging us down in minutia. Wait, you're you're not you, actually okay, stringing I, a sentence oh together, God. and you're saying I'm bogging you down oh in minutia. My God. Like uh, this, here's the interrupting thing. There's a performative interruption thing. You just said a whole line. If you, I wasn't finished though, was I? Okay, try again. Starting from scratch and let give me a wide breath to at least complete the statement. If you give a man a problem, he wants the answer immediately. Okay. If you give a woman a problem, she's gonna want she's gonna want to do the calculus of how we got there in the first place. I would add that if you give the LGBT a problem, they're going to be looking for the social media cameras. They are useless. That's it. Wow. So um so I don't know how any of those things actually um like connect to one another. Honestly, it sounds kind of would like, you like me too? Um, no, like actually, it kind of sounds like you might have dementia, um, and I'm a little worried about that because what you just said was what you just said was was completely okay. rambling and nonsensical. Okay. You said something about uh -huh. men want to solve things for real and women want to do calculus and gays. Well, gays they want social media because they're useless. None of that makes any but, sense. That like this, wow. it feels like your I brain is dripping out of your ears right now. Almost verbatim, as if it didn't make sense. Do you think? That, wait, I have verbatim. a question for you. I have a question for you. What do you what actually I, believe in? What I actually believe. Yeah, yeah. In what, I just is, like I want to pivot off of this like random rambling about uh, what you think about like about like gay uh -huh, people and and all these uh -huh, weird okay. assertions. I want to now, know what I, you believe in. What do you want for America? What I want from America is I want a safe and orderly society. Okay. That's it. And you think? Do you think that the the people that you previously said you didn't care about, the people like storming the 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 uh, the Capitol grounds, do you think that's a safe and orderly society? No, I no. What I said is that that what they did was the inevitable death of the what happens after we lose a safe and organized society. Okay, but you said. Saying, but then earlier, when I asked you whether you thought that our government was currently controlled by race theory marxist you said no it isn't but it's going to be so which one is it um, i'm saying okay the okay uh how could i use um well to paraphrase to use a i'm sorry it sounds stupid but to use a game of thrones analogy i guess the white wall has been broken by who <laughs> the white wall is broken and the and the uh <laughs> And the zombies, the race, the critical race theorists, the LGBTs, they're, they're coming through and they're going to destroy everything they touch. Oh, that's pretty much what I'm saying. I see. So whether or not the Night's Watch is acting up, running for their lives and acting a fool, uh, what do you want me to do? It's, it, it was inevitable. Okay. Remember, remember when I said that it sounds to me like you are living in a fantasy world? That isn't based on actual mm -hmm. fact, but is instead based on well, like, wait, wait, is instead okay. based on you basically writing some kind of fan fiction. This really well, seems to prove my point. Like okay. you're literally saying like, oh, okay. the LGBT zombies are going to touch things and destroy everything. And oh, my God. Uh, and the white wall. Have you seen California wall. lately? Have you seen California, Chicago, Baltimore, Atlanta lately? I mean, I haven't been to Chicago or Atlanta, but I li well, I've then, lived in California well, for a very long time, and I currently live in Seattle. Where do you live? Oh, my, oh, Seattle! I forgot Seattle. Yeah, Seattle was a goddamn shithole too, wasn't it? No, Seattle's actually very nice right now. Yeah, uh, you're not broadcasting from the chop. Wait, the chop doesn't exist anymore. Sure, it doesn't. Wait, it, 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 it literally doesn't. It, wait, uh, do you wait? Wait, okay, do you wait? Well, hold on, hold on a second. Do you think that? Do you think that? Wait, do you actually know what Chop was? Do you know that Chop was six was less than six blocks? Do you know how many? You know how big? A, wait, wait, wait. Hold on, no, no. I, I have to, I have to get this because this is really funny. This is really funny to me. Do you know how big six blocks are in a city approximately? Do you understand how large that is? Do you know what? No, no, no. Um, Answer the question. Do you understand how big six six, six city blocks are? Oh yes, yes. 
Okay, so six city blocks is not a very is not a very large space, and it included a park. Chop was six city blocks, and it was gone. It was it was set up for about a week, and it mostly served. By the way, this is again documented, verifiable fact. I've done multiple videos mm -hmm. on this. Um, mm -hmm. Chop was mostly homeless encampment encampments, and people giving out food mm -hmm. to those homeless. That was the vast majority of CHOP. And, and not, not not the Marxist revolutionaries beating up and robbing, stealing, nope. and, and burning stuff, nope. right? No, not, no none nope. of that. None of it that. actually it was really wasn't. Above. Actually, it really it was wasn't. It's really above funny. Above. As somebody who actually well, lives here, instead of some weird well, LARPing well. dementia patient on the internet, like, uh -huh. yeah, yeah, actually, I, yeah. I, I actually yeah. live here. Look, yeah. I, I, let, let me just assure you that I'm never going to be impressed with name calling. Right? Well, never. I mean, I'm not name calling. I'm actually concerned. Like, uh, maybe you You're should not, put one of your family uh, members on the line. Control, maybe you should put one of your family members on the line and I can ask them if you're getting the carry. Concern trolling went out in, in, in 2012. Please don't concern troll. This is not concern trolling. I am actually genuinely concerned about you. I'm telling you. I'm telling you, you that think there's you think that financial... Seattle you I think wait hold on a second you can't wait no no Lewis Lewis come on you came into this conversation mm -hmm. trying to tell me about the hometown that I live the town that I literally live in right now I literally it's, it's, look it's, out and can see all of Seattle it's literally I mean even know what's going barring... are you a business owner what yes are you a business yes. owner I am a business owner. Do own I am doing my business right now. No, I don't own property in Seattle property because I'm not a bougie fuck. Okay, that's yeah. okay. Now try to get insurance for your business and tell me again. Wait. You're talking from a position of complete ignorance. Do you want to shop? You Do you want to shop insurance business company. insurance right now? You don't know what the insurance companies yeah, are asking you, for. To you don't know what life. you're talking you about. Care. You're literally you making just, shit up. You don't know anything. Hey, did head. you know? Did you know? That basically everything that you're you're motioning at vaguely was completely disproven. Allegedly. No, Allegedly. it actually literally was. See, you Allegedly. don't believe in facts. Now you don't believe in evidence. Again. You believe in what I don't believe in you. Listen, you believe in picking believe in, in picking and choosing. Much like what you I said at the beginning, the you are writing thinking. a fantasy in your mind and you live in a fantasy world if that is not so. based on reality. If and when I tell so. you, hey, ask, ask hold on a second. Stop. How, Can you please just shut the fuck up for one second, please? Ask business owners. You don't own anything. Can you please shut the fuck up right now? You don't own anything. Can you please shut the fuck up right now? I'm going to ask you one last, one more time sure. before I mute you. You've been ranting and sure, raving sure. about things that are completely made up. And when I tell you, did you know oh, wow. that that is verifiably false? That if you go right now and drive into town, into Seattle, and you go to Capitol Hill, there is no chop there. In fact, just recently, <laughs> the police went in and beat up and destroyed the property of a whole bunch of homeless people who had taken shelter in an empty public park. That is the reality on the ground. And people who know here know this. Everybody who lives in this state knows this. Anybody who lives in this city knows this shit. This is why we don't have, we're not like, we don't have a Trump cult here. Because when, when all of the people like Tucker Carlson and all of whoever else you fucking watch, you conservatives delude yourselves with, they're like, Seattle is literally on fire. And it's like, no, it isn't. And during the actual, during the heat of the high, of the biggest protests in the, in the history of this city, there was like one dumpster that was set on fire and you people will freak out and what about piss the yourselves. Lives lost? What's that? What about the lives lost? What lives lost? Oh God. Which ones are you talking about? Are the you talking- The young black child that was shot, the, the vehicles that was shoot, the, the vehicle shootings? Oh, the vehicle shooting. Yeah, you mean the guy who was driving? You, you mean the guy who was driving his car across a uh, across a a public yeah, park towards housing, oh and then God, and then you. over overzealous uh, people with guns shot them. Hey, what about the uh, what about the people who were killed on the no, highway? Don't what about? Don't what about it? Yeah, it's not what about is You just did a what about ism. I literally don't just what, asked no, you. You don't even know what you're talking about, and then you said what about the what about the guy shot? I'm sorry. You're what? trying to you're trying to morally. I corrected your assessment. You didn't correct of, of the shit. damage done, and you you didn't correct you shit. You pivoted to something okay. completely what unrelated. You stuff? said that Seattle is a, like a, a burning shithole that's taken over by Chop, and it proves that you know nothing Basically. about what's going on the ground here, and you also don't give a shit about any of these people. Now that's the definition of c concern what trolling. People, what people are you talking about? See, that's the problem. The with people you. who you live here, you terms. you what clawed. People, what people do you think you're like? I mean, blue staters, they could they could burn in their own excrement, it, personally. Nice. Hello? So now so now what you're yeah, doing, so now all you're doing is just saying you hate blue people. You literally only have feelings. All you do is I feel. Am a 
conservative. You are a you are a am, no you listen. You're you may call yourself a conservative, but what you actually are is a man baby. That's what you actually are. You are a child in a man's body tiny. and you and you approach the world like a child. You feel and you say mm -hmm. your little biases mm -hmm. and then you project them on everyone else. Mm -hmm. You've come in here and uh -huh. and shown no evidence for anything and you've in fact stated oh factually false things. And when I ask you what evidence mm -hmm. do you possibly have, you say, well, you know, mm -hmm. evidence doesn't matter. What mm -hmm. do you mean evidence? Because what you want when, to do what, what, is live in your little Game matter. of Thrones fantasy. Wait, 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 wait. When did I say evidence doesn't matter? I said that I'm going to present to you the phenomenons that I've observed. The phenomenons that you, you and then when you when those are when those are questioned, you immediately just I conclude. You, you immediately conclude your biases. I provided alternative so possible my, interpretations of events that you claim you to have tried witnessed. You to whitewash a death. What? You tried to whitewash a death, and I called you out. What? On what? What death don't, did don't I whitewash? Test. You are not. I never the whitewashed the death. I literally talked about it. Vehicle. We know, I know, trust me, I assure you, uh, Lewis, Lewis, listen, Lewis, Lewis, I know you want to cry really loud right now. Lewis, 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 I know you're getting very worked up right now, but I can tell you, I know, I can tell you, I know a lot more about the deaths that happened in this town than you do. You don't even, could you even, could you even point to, wait, 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 listen, could you even point to Seattle on the map? Could you even point to Seattle on the map? Could you even point to Seattle on a map? The phone? Yes. Really? What a waste of time. Yeah. What a I don't think you know where Seattle is. That's fine. I don't know you the well that well to try and prove it. I'm just telling you that you don't care about the death of a young black man. You don't even know. It, it, you don't it, even it, know. It wait, wait. Don't. Excuse me. I do. I Absolutely. You you don't. In fact, I talked about it on my channel back when it happened. It's really funny. You don't care. No, nah, you you're wrong. Again, you feel that way, but if you want to go into my channel history, you can Please. find my video on it. I don't have to. You don't even know. Okay. What, wait, did you that's even know? Okay. Did you even know that, that, that Chop was in Capitol Hill? Do you even know what Capitol Hill neighborhood is? Capital Autonomous Zone. Yeah, do you know what it was? Do you know where it was? Which side was, of Seattle was it on? It was an insurrection. Wow, I'm which not, side I'm of not, Seattle was it on? I'm not Googler. Uh, you don't bark, even know a shit bark, about it. You have, you have a lot to, to say. You show. have a lot to say about these places that you've never you're been. Your fantasy about the show. LGBT zombies storming over the wall and all of this nonsense. You live in a fantasy, oh, Lewis. Yeah. Hey, you live hey, in a fantasy you, world. Hey. Hey, 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 just for the record, did you like my analogy about Milo? What? That, when I said that, when I said that he was like Jon Snow gathering the 13 tribes of the Manosphere and conservatism to protect Donald Trump's wall, did you like that analogy? You know, I don't, did you ever say that? Yeah, well, I, I texted. You texted it? I love that guy. I love me some Milo. Wow. I love, he cares. Sure. He cares about black people and he doesn't collect super chat Wait, for it. you think that... Wait, you think Milo doesn't collect super chats for it? You are deluded. He doesn't collect. Have you ever looked uh, at Milo's career? Do you know? Do you know he that? Do you know that Milo? Sport. Did you know that Milo made millions of dollars writing racist articles for Breitbart for years? You should go look into his articles that he's written about black people. Not only. <sighs> Also, Milo's a Milo's pedo. Milo's Are you really going to defend a pedo here? Well, look. I mean, it would it would it would be perfect. It would be perfect. Don't go there. Don't go there. Oh, it's really funny. Don't go there because then I'm going to bosh. I mean, wait. You, I, I don't. don't wait, what are, you, what are you talking about? Don't go there. Don't go there. Do you oh, want you know to watch that about. clip no, of Milo on two different, you're, on two you're different podcasts? Fan, right? you're, you're, you pattern your show after Vosh, and Vosh is a pedo. Yeah, you don't have evidence of that, but I got evidence. I got a lot of evidence of Milo. Milo oh, literally went on. Uh, and what was the show he went on? He oh, went on uh, Drunken Peasants. Oh, yeah, oh, Milo went on Drunken oh, Peasants about what was it about two years ago now? And he openly stated that he believed that older men should molest younger I have men. To, I watched. I watched that in real time. I watched Ooh, it in real damn, time. Ooh, damn! Looks like you. You just said he was a good boy. He was your favorite. Damn, He's my that hero. sucks. He's my hero. He's yeah, a, he was a master. Wow, soul. your hero's a your hero he openly was, advocates for pedophilia. Know, well, listen, this has been very fun. I'm glad that we were able yeah. to establish that you have no, you don't even live in reality. I don't even know if you know oh, where legend. you are right now. You literally yeah, don't know Mark. anything about anything you're talking about, Mark and everything you do, everything you do is feelings. Mm -hmm. You worship a pedophile, uh -huh. literally. You like just Mark. admitted to it, and I'm guessing. Like Mark. No, you don't have evidence of that, but I got evidence of mine. Like what? Provide the evidence, bitch. 
Josh is a yeah. All right. This he is, is funny. Th- uh, it, it's incredibly funny um, how confidently you were willing to talk in the he comments about how you were going to own. Pedophile. You're a pedophile. There you go. I'm sure. Yeah, I have as much evidence. Thanks. I have as much evidence of That's you being a pedophile. Hey, show. listen, listen. Hey, I buddy, buddy, Lewis. You have as much evidence about Vosh as I have about you. So I think it's perfectly fair. If yeah, you're going to call Vosh a pedophile, I'm going to call you a Vosh pedophile. Is... You also just openly yeah, admitted I on my care, channel, Louis Cypher. Louis Cypher literally just came in here, showed he doesn't know anything about the places he talked about, and mm-hmm. then said he worships a pedophile. Mm-hmm. So, mm-hmm. all right, I think mm-hmm. we're pretty good here. Mm-hmm. I think I've determined that you're Thanks. not worth talking to because I genuinely think you were lost in a fantasy. So, uh... You good? You, you nice haven't, are you having a quit wank? Did you get really, did you get like nice, really nice worked up about talking about all that, that pedophilia? Cheering as you run. Are you jacking off to children right now? He's jacking nice off to children right now. Okay, all right, dude. Pack. Listen, I didn't even get into the real policies. That's the sad uh, thing. Because you don't, uh, I, listen, it is impossible to have a, conversi- a conversation about policy with someone. Here, here, Wait a no, second. No, nah, I was talking. It is impossible to have a conversation about policy with someone who believes that LGBT zombies are crossing a, an imaginary white wall and they're going to take apart civilization because Atlanta and Chicago and Seattle were turned into Baltimore. war zones by the LGBT BLM Marxist. You're, I'm sorry. I, I hate to tell you this, but you are an insane person. And I think that you should probably reconsider the way that you engage with the world, because the way you engage, well, look, the way that you engage with the world right now is pure fantasy. You are lost in mm-hmm. a, in, a, in a complete mm-hmm. world of of madness. Mm-hmm. Nothing is actual fact. Mm-hmm. So I I mm-hmm. think you would be happier if you learned to rethink the way that you approach the world. And with that, I think we're going to end it By right way, now. Stop, I just look. I just want, stop exploiting black people for super chats, dude. That's all I'm saying. Uh. Good. Okay, I will do that. I have never done that, so that's great. Already done. Mission accomplished. Any other hot memes you want to drop before you go? Um. Yeah, we're moving into a post-interdependent society. Uh, men need to start worrying about their own political needs. Have a nice day. Yeah. See ya. There we go. All right. That was great. Wasn't that fascinating? Wasn't that fascinating? I finally get a right winger on here. Yeah, post women society. Um, yeah, that was very, very interesting. I do believe that was an insane person.